Hi everybody and welcome back to Ryan Fulton's Cars and today we have a nice goodie haul here. I went to the baseball card shop on Friday, November 6th, which was my birthday. And this is the goodies I picked up. And this is the card shop I went to. Cardboard Legends in Van Nuys, California. Here's all their wonderful things. I've been going to the, the shop lately. Got a whole bunch of boxes. And a whole bunch of, of singles and stuff. So this is what I got, just to let you know. Um, first off, I bought also six packs of 2019 Tops update. Because I still needed six cards to finish up the set. Which I ended up getting four cards out of the out of six. So, so I still need two more. So these are the four cards I needed that I got in the pack. Was the Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Debut card, the Carlos Santana All Star, the Scott Borg, and this home run and shutout Noah Syndergaard. So those are the four cards I needed out of the set. And then he also had a whole bunch of the uh, 2020 Heritage. So I went through a whole bunch of this. These are all the cards I I got that I needed. To finish up the set. Or, I mean, not to finish the set, but at least for the set. I'm not going to go through all those. And then, um, I still needed one more Dominguez card, so I ended up picking this up. Okay, and then here's some of the, the goodies that were in the, in the, um, update packs. The Vlad, uh, Cody Bellinger family business, the Mike Moustakis number to 9699. It's the vintage stock. There's a gold in this insert, a worn spawn insert. And then here's some of the good rookies that were in it Pete Alonzo, rookie debut, rookie. Calvin Biggio, rookie debut. Eli Jimenez, rookie debut. Uh, Kirsten Hugawa, rookie. Austin Riley rookie, a Pete Alonzo um, All Star Game rookie, Nick Senzel rookie debut, Hirsen Higawa a deb rookie debut, a Nick Senzel rookie, a Fernando Tatis Jr. rookie debut, and a Vladimir Guerrero home run derby rookie. So those are the the main good cards I got, and then here's the rest of the cards. Not gonna, like I said, not gonna go through all this, but there's that. So let's get those out of the way, and then those are those are some stuff I need to pack some stuff, and then the other singles I got along with the Dominguez. We'll start with these. I just picked out some of my stuff that I like to PC. I mean, there was some other stuff there, but I didn't get everything. But here's some of the stuff I PC'd with the Ken Griffey Jr. from 1996 Pacific. This was an, I guess, an insert, but I just like the design. And then I got a nice Frank Thomas the same year. And then we got this Jeff Bagwell. I think it's a red variation from Pacific Crown, also um, from 96. And how most of it's in Spanish and in English. I guess it's a called maybe Red Hot Stars. Another Pacific Frank Thomas. I like the design of this one. This one is nice. This one is also from 96. Maybe it's called Fence Blasters. Same thing with the Griffey. Now he's got one lonely Packer card. And then I got some more Luis Roberts that I needed. Um, this one is from the Bowman Chrome Prospects. And we got the Talent Pipeline with Andrew Vaughn. And uh, Micker uh, Alfalo. I don't know how to pronounce his name. Then one of the uh, Spinning the Globes, Luis Robert. Okay. Oh, yeah, and this the Joshua card is also number four out of 99. Gold 
label or gold standard from 2020. And then we got this pretty cool looking Frank Thomas Sports Flicks with Jeff Bagwell on it. This one's pretty cool. I like it. It says taken double on it. And this is what the back looks like. Looks like number one. This is, looks like from 1995. And then you got this Frank Thomas from Sports Flick. And this one is from Pinnacle Sports Flicks from 96. And then we got this Michael Jordan on the White Sox. I believe this is this says 2000. This is 94 on it, but I think this is a 2005 card. This is a uh, second year card. And then we got this nice, nice Frank Thomas right here. Memorable moments. And this is the back. This is from um, 97 Upper Deck. And we got an Albert Bell in the White Sox uniform here. Looks like a TV kind of thing uh, from Collector's Choice. Touch them all, it says around it. This is from uh, also 97. I, just, I like it because it's the White Sox. And Albert Bell was a decent player. And so here's the Frank Thomas 2 version. And then there's the back. And then we got this Eli Jimenez uh, Gold Cup card from uh, 2020 Chrome, Topps Chrome. Uh, freshman Flash Dylan Cease. Zach Collins, rookie from Bowman Chrome. And then uh, Michael Kopeck Refractor from 2019 Tops Chrome. We got one of these like Prism Refractors, also from Kopeck from 2019 Tops Chrome. We got Dylan Cease, C Rookie of the Year favorites from Bowman 2020 Chrome. Also an Andrew Vaughn Chrome prospect from 2020. Tim Anderson from Topps Chrome. It's a refractor also. From 2020. Topps. And then you got an Eloy Jimenez. Look at the cuts all really bad on this one. You didn't even see the line that was supposed to cut down there. From the 85 Topps design. Excuse me. <sighs> got a yawn there. And we got Mike Piazza. With Carlos Delgado sports flick. This one also says double take or take double. Probably double take. It has Piazza and Del Carlos Delgado. It's a nice looking one too. And I got this nice Piazza. Premier Power from Collector's Choice. It's also um, from 97. And we got another prism, like one of those prism refractors. This one's a Cody Bellinger. And then, they're, then we got the Coley Bellinger Refractor along with a Clayton Kershaw Refractor from 2020. Tops Chrome. And we got this nice looking Ken Griffey Jr. The Griffey Years. A, a cut abode. It says Teenage Rookie. This is an upper deck. It's probably from a, a rookie collection set, probably. The upper deck did in 95, I think. Here we go. There's a Collector's Choice. Tanger for just a nice looking one here. And there's the back. This is also from 97. I said the guy had a whole bunch. I just, had a, just happened to have a couple boxes that he got from somebody. And the guys were kind of like had it on the on the counter. And I was just I was like, oh, let me, let me look through it. And they're like, okay. So I ended up picking out. I didn't even go through the whole, through all the boxes. There was like three or four boxes there. We got this King Griffey Jr. Premier Power. This was from 1997 also. And then we got this Ken Griffey Jr. Tribute. And this one's numbered 124 to 199. This is Topps Tribute 2012. Then we got this nice Jeff Bagwell here. Even the, the feeling is... It is pretty cool. It's from uh, Leaf Studios in 96. 
uh, Master Strokes, and it's actually a pro sample ca card, and it's a promo number to 5,000 of this one. I like, I like so it's pretty nice. And then we got Mark McGuire from the uh, Touch Em All way back uh, Collector's Choice. And then we got some hockey too. We happen to have some hockey in there. And then they got this Dylan Larkin uh, canvas card from 2019, from 2019, 20 upper deck. And then we got this uh, flip Z Zarna. I don't know how to pronounce it. Rookie uh, shooting the stars from 2019, 20 upper deck. And then uh, also got this nice. Larry Bird Prism. I think it's a red, white, and blue. Not really fan on the basketball scopes, but baseball, they do it the red, white, and blue. And uh, this is from 2019 2020 Prism. Oops. Also got this uh, Seth Rollins autograph, Dirt Relic card, 43 uh, out of 50. And I don't let's see this product is undisputed from Tops uh, WWE Undisputed 2018. And then I got this Max Muncy from Museum Collection. It's a 148 and a 199 dual relic autograph from 2020. So all these cards. Except for the 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 update and the tops update, the guy said, "Just make oh and just he said just make me an offer since it was your birthday since it was my birthday and he would accept whatever offer I I wanted and uh, I was like well I don't want to like do it too low so I offered him thirty five for the stack he he said I can have it for thirty so I was like okay so pretty much I got this stack. And this deck of cards for thirty bucks. Okay, plus you know, plus the, the these Luis Roberts and the and the Jason Dominguez card. I got it all for for thirty bucks. So then the whole reason I came, time for the boxes, was that excuse me. Is that Tops update came out? So I got two of those boxes, and then and he threw in. He gave me those two boxes plus. I saw this uh, uh, first round pick or first round uh, top pro top class Nick Mandigold, like jumbo card from two thousand eighteen. I think it was Bowman Draft Chrome. I'm not sure. And this one's number 98 out of 99 up there. He gave me the, the two boxes plus that for 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 200 bucks. And then for another hundred, he gave me the he gave me these boxes. And then this box plus the Steve Club was another hundred. So I got all everything here for for 430 bucks. So let's see what bo other boxes I got. So I got another box of 2020 Heritage Meyer League, which I'm going to open up with the other one together in the next probably few days. And then I uh, got some hockey here. We got this Bowman uh, from 1987, the CHL. So this is like minor league stuff. So there's a chance for autographs. I guess in here, the price on it's not what I paid for it. Like I said, he gave me like five bucks, five boxes for pretty much twenty bucks. So it's a hundred bucks for five boxes. Okay, and then uh, do another hockey. It was this 95, 96 Bowman NHL cards. And then I'll, I don't know if y'all you remember this, but you have, but you have. Uh, 1994 Upper Deck Fun Packs. I believe there is a, a, a Michael Jordan rookie card in here. In this set. 
So, and I figured it would just be a fun, wacky little product to, to open up. Especially if you can't get a Michael Jordan rookie card for on the White Sox. And then I also got this. 92-93 Fleer Ultra for hockey. It has some really good looking cards. Good inserts and that stuff. And then a box of... Nothing too spectacular in this one. But this is a 1991 box of studio. So there is a chance to get a Jeff Bagwell rookie card in it or several so that's pretty much what i got at the shop let me know what you guys think you know i'm gonna be opening up some of these boxes in the next few probably next few weeks you know depending on on what to do plus i have like i still have a few other boxes i haven't opened up yet and then I also have a, a, mail day, a mail day video too. I'll open up some mail. Probably my next one after, right after I do this. So that's what I got. So, so feel free what, what card you liked. What you thought was the best. Uh, what, what box you thought was the best. Um, make sure you please subscribe. Uh, tell your friends to subscribe. Give me a thumb bu thumbs up. Uh, check out my other videos. And please help me with the channel. And uh, check out my, my stuff at uh, on eBay at GoPacker79. And check, up, check out and see what I have up there. Alright. Until next time, have a good day. Bye.